So if you guys watch my channel a lot, you know I love LEGO clearance deals. And sometimes, you know, they're just not there, but sometimes you get really good deals. And as of late, it's been pretty, pretty rough. But uh, I recently found some amazing deals. And it's not my first time finding deals like this. And I just wanted to talk about it in today's video and show you guys some crazy, crazy LEGO deals. So sometimes here in Canada, we get some really good deals at Walmart. Um, if you guys watch my channel, like I said, you see some vlogs of me recording and getting some like 50, 60, 70% off deals. It happens a lot here uh, in my province in Newfoundland. Um, I don't always see it in Ontario and places like that, but it does happen in other spots. Actually, I recommend if you guys live in Canada, just get this out of the way. Uh, there's some great groups on Facebook. I'll take screenshots of putting them in the video here. There's some great groups and they, uh, there's people always posting, uh, Costco, Walmart, everything deals. So I would recommend checking that out. Nonetheless, um, got that out of the way. Um, there's some times where I get really good deals, 50, 60, 70% off here in my province of Newfoundland. And it seems like my province is kind of like an outlier in that kind of mix. You don't see that in Ontario, Vancouver, uh, British Columbia, stuff like that. And, um, Sometimes I get this wicked deal like I'm about to show you guys. For the most part, you know, most I get is like 75% off, but every now and again, I come across some crazy deals. Now, I haven't really found a deal like this since I want to say 2018. Um, I actually have screenshots of it. I'll show you guys pictures of the receipts and everything. But back in 2017, 2018, I actually found the Yoda's Jedi Starfighter and General Grievous's uh, speeder for two cents each. Now that was a crazy good deal at the time. Um, it was a really good find. I managed to get six sets in total for two cents each, which is literally nothing. And it was an awesome pickup for me when I was just starting to uh, get back into collecting and start reselling and stuff. Through the years since I got those deals, there have been other people finding two cent sets uh, here and there. There's groups on Instagram that I'm in where people find them uh, here in Canada. There's gr groups on Facebook, like I said, people find them here in Canada. It's all it's random um, and I'll get into more of why that actually happens where, where they go down to two cents but first I want to talk about my recent pickups for two cents so like I said it's not every day this happens but recently I was able to get two sets for two cents each um, I got this new Jurassic World set um, this the T-Rex dinosaur breakout a four plus set and I got the lifeguard or beach lifeguard station from Lego City for two cents each now uh, these are stickers on there for 39.59 but I can show you their two cents. Um, I kind of was just so excited to get them at the time that I didn't really properly photograph it or record it or anything. But I can assure you their two cents. Um, I have the proof of the previous ones, just in case you guys don't believe me. And I'm sure if you stop track.ca every now and again here in Canada, you can find sets that are also two cents. Nonetheless, these are great to get. Um, and I will get into more of why these are two cents here in a second. But uh, yeah, let me know down below if you guys have ever found any sets for two cents before. But to basically explain why some sets can go down for that cheap, I want to uh, give you some more information about what Walmart does. So you're, ever gonna, you're only ever going to find a deal like this at Walmart here in Canada, uh, where they clearance out sets every like two weeks or so, um, usually in waves when the winter and spring, fall, summer, whatever, when they get new sets released, Lego uh, sends those new sets in the retailers and they clear out the old sets, so therefore stuff gets put on clearance like this was regular 39.86 and then it went down to 39 which is literally 86 cents off but uh eventually it went down two cents but anyway um first they usually shove it on initial clearance um and then they do a second third and fourth clearance um sometimes it will just go straight down to two cents that would be the first clearance and um they would just clear it out but it usually goes in waves so 39 then you get 29 19 and then it'll be two cents for example but basically that happens every week two weeks depending on your walmart how much stock they have and everything and it can eventually get to the point where you have two cents. Um, and basically two cents on a Lego set or any item at a Walmart means they're clearing it out completely. It's not supposed to sell on shelves. They're just sending it back to the retailer to get it redistributed to wholesalers. Uh, like, you know, you get those Amazon pallets. I'm sure you guys have seen those Amazon pallet videos on YouTube before. They get a bunch of uh, returned items or stuff like that. Uh, that is basically what happens when it gets two cents. Um, every employee, I guess, is supposed to pull it off the floor. They send it back to the warehouses on pallets and then they sell it to wholesalers, which might include someone like Costco who sells it at a cheaper price than retail. Um, but basically that is what the two set sets mean. And basically, um, I guess that means you can't, well, they're not supposed to really sell it. Um, but like the way it works, you know, if it's on the shelf, you can buy it. Like that's not going to hurt. Um, and that's basically what happens here. You go through the checkout and you can get it no problem. But uh, if, it's, uh, if it's not on the shelf in the back, they're not going to haul it out for you. If it's two cents, that means it's supposed to be recalled. Um, sometimes it is a recall, too. 
but you know, like, oh, like, this is not getting recalled because of some hazard issue. It's going to be, um, you know, re two cents because it's on end of life and it's retiring. That leaves a great opportunity for some people to get some amazing deals. Uh, like I said, um, recently there has been a lot of sets going on for two cents. I've known other people in my area that have gotten some sets. Actually, more of these have went on two cents in some of my local Walmarts. Um, of course, we have three here in St. John's, Newfoundland. Uh, this was just at one of them. I got two of them. But across the city, there was also another person that got some for two cents. There's one in the middle of the city got two cents. Um, and there's just a bunch of sets going on. Uh, like the T-Rex breakout. You got the Beach Lake guard, Bodyguard. There's some Harry Potter, like uh, Hogwarts Castle sets and stuff going on for two cents. Along with some City Inn in Ninjago. Uh, there has been no Star Wars as of now. But even if like there's some in the back and it's not put it on shelf, eventually it will go on two cents. And maybe you have the chance to get it, but it's something to keep an eye out for here in Walmart in Canada for you guys that are big into clearance finding and might not even know about this. So to keep an eye out for that, I would recommend looking at the Facebook groups, um, seeing when they go on two cents. Uh, that's actually how I was alerted to this. And then I check my local uh, Walmarts through stockcheck.ca, which I've been telling you guys about forever now. It is the number one spot if you're hearing. Uh, Canada and looking for clearance deals at Walmart, use stocktrack.ca, you'll find your deals. But basically check my local, local Walmart stock for uh, any sets that might be two cents. It might not show it right away, but you just keep digging through the sets and uh, you'll find the ones that are on clearance that have dropped the two cents like these two. I was actually there the day before and noticed these were still on the shelf, so I went and picked them up, went through the checkouts and paid for them, no problem. But if you're a big Lego clearance hunter, I definitely recommend doing that, especially if you're here in Canada. I don't know if there's anything like that in the U.S. I wouldn't be able to speak to the U.S., but it's something to keep an eye out for if you're here in Canada, like I said, and looking for Lego clearance deals. It's definitely worth your time just to look through stock tracks, see if you're any local Walmarts have that. Um, of course, it's going to be a bit harder to find that in a place like Toronto and Ontario. Um, it's going to be more in rural places like Nova Scotia, New Brunswick, maybe even Quebec, um, Saskatchewan. Uh, there's a lot of places across Canada that have, you know, a lot of stock that doesn't sell and that's how you get those two cent sets where they can be out on clearance for so long that they eventually get clearance out to two cents. But everyone, that is all I really have to say. So I hope you all enjoyed. Um, the proof is in the pudding here. Uh, if you don't believe me, you can try and hunt for yourself. I've, I'll pull, pull multiple images from people on uh, you Facebook and everything to show you guys that it's real, but uh, it is real and you can get them for two cents. But I hope you all enjoyed. Um, I hope you can find some of your own. And with all that said, uh, let me know down in the comments below if you have before. If you do, um, I don't really have anything else to add. So I hope you uh, guys find something happy hunting, clearance hunting. Uh, like the video if you enjoyed. Subscribe to the channel also helps. And I'll catch you all in the next video.